and loaders are being used to start clearing away tons of sand brought ashore by the storm surge. Dan Maloney of Point Pleasant says he's leaving because there's no telling when electricity might be restored. The widespread power outage also means most gas stations in New Jersey are shut down. There are long lines of cars at the few that are open. Craig Wingen, NPR News. New York City is making a slow comeback. NPR's Margot Avenue airport ship buses are running. Two airports are open tomorrow. That's the image. That is a brilliant image. Is that in black and white as well? Is that amazing? Yeah. You get the kids, right? I think I did. Yeah. Wow. Oh, yeah, so it's doing good. Good afternoon, I mean, anyone who tried to drive into Manhattan today from Brooklyn and Queens knows how slow and aggravating that can be. I've ordered that the four East River bridges be restricted to high occupancy vehicles only tonight, uh, in, coming into Manhattan, meaning three or more people per vehicle, uh, all day on Thursday and all day on Friday from 6 a.m. to midnight. Mayor Bloomberg says Governor Cuomo is agreed to put the same restrictions on the Triborough and Henry Hudson bridges. Look at all that. Oh, shit. Tunnel. He says uh, the George Washington bridge oh, will be exempt because he says most of those travelers are bound for I-95. Excuse my language, Facebook is. There is now limited service <laughs> on the Long Island Railroad as the city's mass transit system is coming back from the superstorm Sandy. Subways will be back in service tomorrow morning, but not everywhere. WNYC's Andrea Bernstein is at the briefing with NTA Chief Joe Loda. There will be no service in Manhattan anywhere below 34th Street, and there will be no subway service from Brooklyn to Manhattan. Instead, there will be a shuttle bus running from Brooklyn to Manhattan. Did you see that? Whoa. Great. Whoa. Great. 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 But it's, uh, yeah, that's a strange thing, I think. Yeah. Staff are asked to report to work on Friday. Mayor says many schools are damaged or are still without power. He apologized. And in sports, the next season opener tomorrow night at the New York Park Center. Ooh, that last. Oh, my word. Thank you. 